Hey guys, and welcome back to Cold Fear. I've managed to get us kind of back to where we were. I may have missed a log or two, and uh, I did skip out the upper deck because there was nothing in there, but I have just picked up the key for the upper deck, ironically enough. Now, it is the upper deck key, isn't it, that we have? It's the crew quarters. Let's no, we didn't go into the armory because we have plenty of bullets. That is the upper deck key that we've just picked up. Find the emergency radio code. Upper deck key. Yep, okay. So I'm guessing this is the way to the upper deck. Now, I have been told by uh, one of my friends that there is no save room per se, which is really frustrating. Apparently, your uh, the game is saved Locked. when you make it uh, X far through, and you hit certain scenarios, certain milestones, if you will. And I'm not a fan of that, considering just how easy it is to die. But we shall persevere. I'm guessing. Nope. I was about to say I'm guessing that's a save point, but I guess not. Crew quarters. Okay. Right, one second, guys. I've got to turn my headset down. This game is so, so loud. Oh, my God. I couldn't hear myself think. Right, too hot for me that way. All right. Let's have a look in the crew quarters. Ah. Hey, friend. Okay, I guess these guys are hostile. Oof. You know, there's a lot of guys still alive here. It kind of feels wrong to be shooting these chaps. Surely we should be trying to uh, work out how to cooperate. Pistol ammo. I guess cooperation is out of... Uh, out of the question. Well, I mean, especially when you're using liberal amounts of bullets into their faces. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably going to make them a little bit salty. Let's check out the galley. There's blood going into the galley. I was just about to say, is there anything in the fridge? There's always something in the fridge. No luck. Looks like we've got some gas going. Wow, so this outbreak must have happened. Um... Out of nowhere, then. Everyone was, uh, you know, going business as usual. The galley looked like it was still being used. Let's keep going. I would really like a map. I guess we're not going to get one, though. Okay. Right, that leads... Oh, God. Oh, shit. Like, what the hell is going on? Someone's shooting at us. That's what's going on. Let's go back through here, because I think there's some more doors we could check. Let's cover all of our bases before we move on. We still haven't seen any of these uh, alien things yet. I guess technically they're from Earth. They're not exactly aliens. All right, what's this way? That's the showers. Ooh la la. Oh. Captain's quarters. Let's go have a look at the captain. Ah, oh, what? I thought it might be locked. I am disappointed. Alright, come on, Tom. Let's check out the sh Oh. What the hell is that? Uh. That is a man that apparently is still alive stay back uh, Tom can you get your gun out please thank you we got lucky there pistol ammo this guy was really not having a good time there nothing again 
Jesus Christ. Look at that. This guy got fucked. Nothing on him. Yeah, not surprised. Wow, this dude. Oh, he's not actually dead. I think he's just rocking because of the ship. I don't know. Maybe. That was a bit strange. I don't know if he was actually dead or if he was just rocking with the waves. Not sure. Either way, he's probably dead now. I mean, he didn't have most of his head missing. Now he's got his whole head missing. You know what they say? Half a head's better than none. Okay, alright. Let's keep going. Seem to be getting a lot of ammo in this game. Uh, although, at least for the beginning, anyway. Right, let's keep going. Yeah, not a fan of the save system. Um, because, like, if I die any time around now, I've got to do all this again. I want some kind of save room. This guy's got, like, a machine gun. I hit him. Come on, you fuck. Come on, you. Let's see ya. Oh, I don't know how I'd hit him on the PS2. He's backed off. Yeah, I'm not sure how I'd hit him on the PS2. Kind of lucky. Lucky because of the resolution. You can see the dot on him. Right, let's have a little look, shall we? A note about barrels. Please tell me about barrels. The standard regulations for storage of explosive chemicals are not being followed. Uh, neither on our supply ships nor on the drilling platform itself. I have even seen barrels lying around that are not tied down. I ask you to exercise your authority to remedy this situation. I know that these barrels can be extremely effective against our enemies. Therefore, even if it means using them as weapons, I would prefer to decide on their positions with you. I will ensure that my men use them wisely. Okay. Right. Well, explosive barrels. I mean, that sounds good. I like the water effect. That's kind of interesting. The air is clear so far. Hey, what the hell that guy's shooting at? There he is. I mean, that's some severe bullshit right there. Yeah, we got him. Oh, God. Get out of here, sir. Alright, what have you got for me? Pistol ammo. Fuck, look at this dude. Is that a zombie? Was it a zombie? Or was he just fucked up by the zombie? Damn, man. We've got a harpoon gun. I wonder if that harpoon gun's going to get used at some point. Probably. I, mean, I guess it makes sense for a whaler to have a harpoon gun. Nothing on him. Alright, the game's being exceedingly stingy right now. We can't even interact with it. Alright. Okay. So, that is interesting. Let's remove the brain, shall we? Oh, there's a lot of barrels down here, guys. I get the feeling there's some... Who said that? You. Dude, we could have been friends, you know? We could have been having a beer together at the end of this. But no. But no, you had to combat roll. Try and be a hero of some description. Alright, let's have a little look around here, shall we? Still see none of these alien bastards. None of these mutoids. You would have thought we would have seen something by now. What's... Can we go through here? I guess so. Oh. Dude, if you didn't combat roll and announce your presence, maybe you would have got some hits on me. 
Maybe. There's a lot of shit in here. Let's grab the med kit. Ah, much better. Yeah, I'd really like a save spot now, game, please. I'm just saying, it's been a while. Been playing for like. Well, I wouldn't say close to an hour, but. If all the checkpoints in the game are going to be this spread out, that's going to be difficult, to say the least. But it's okay, we shall persevere. That door looks like it's kind of open. Alright, let's go. No, that's just the lighting. Oof, God. Oh, that guy looks like he's still alive. You out there, dude? Yeah, sorry, pal. Where I come from, we don't take chances. Another med kit there. A page from Dr. Kamchi's diary. Now, we already read one of these earlier. Note on XL infects infection. We have deliberately infected and observed over 300 sub 300 subjects, really, uh, including dogs, apes, orcas, and human beings. Those subjects have been placed under permanent biometric surveillance and dissected to accurately chart the growth of the XL organism and help us learn how to control the process, infection and change. The time it takes an infected individu individual to mutate depends on two factors. How long it takes the exo uh, cell to get a tendril into the victim's brain oof, and the infected body's natural resistance. At present, we have no way of knowing how long the complete process takes for a given individual. Since body mass, height and age seem to be of little importance, any individual infected by an exo cell should be given the antidote as quick as possible. Okay, so they can cure it. If no antidote is available, host's brain must be destroyed. And I mean destroyed. To prevent the subject from becoming an active and potentially contaminating host. Indeed, the exocell seems to be able to reanimate a brain that has been clinically dead for several days. Oof. So, we're going to be destroying every brain we come into contact with then. I can see a brain and we can't pop that one so I'm going to assume he's gonna jump out at us oh right yes yeah, so those they are alive but they're being infected yeah you can see him in there yeah we we can't do anything to him he's gonna be a jumper Pistol rounds. Let's see just how effective the handgun is. Oh man. Yeah, he's fucked up. Oh, dude. Uh oh. At least I found the code. Oof. Hey, buddy. You alright there? Ooh. And we've got another one. Shit. Ooh, God. I like that. Oof. Yeah, gotta destroy the brain. Ah, and they dissolve away. Oh, dude, that was cool. That was really cool. Okay, I like that. Alright. So, we got the code. Now we just need... Now we just need to get back. I'm guessing now we have these exocells. Every frickin' where. Let's go. They're tough. 
do you want oh really so man you have um a lot of game and i mean a lot of game to get through before you get to save oh dude dude Dude, stop shooting me! What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, you morons. Right, your head's gone. Your head's gone. Your head's gone. Oof. Yeah. Suddenly, I kind of wish we had more ammo. They actually drop ammo. That's good to know. Right, any more of you bastards coming out to play? Any Whoa! What the... F uh, holy shit! Um, maybe climb up? Right, let's... let's Fuck that noise. Let's get out of here. Quicker rather than slower, buddy. Right, have you got any ammo? Here we go. Brace. Oh my god. Let's just run. Just run. Just run, dude. Just run. Holy shit. You would not want to be on this ship. Get inside. Oh man, I'm glad to be back inside. Yeah, I didn't even know there were stairs here, but sure. Uh, not sure that I want to put the fire out just yet. I have to find a magnetic card. Oh, great. Great. Magnetic card. Whoa! Dude, this is actually really cool. I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, so we're above where we were. It looks like we've got a load of magazines there. Oh god, right. What are these? I haven't got the weapon for this ammo. Yeah, well, that's not really my problem, is it? Oh, I don't have the weapon for this ammo. It's a fucking grenade launcher here. I'm just going to leave it until I get the ammo. Fucking moron. Honestly. Alright. Well, let's keep going up. God, what a numb nuts. Jesus Christ. God, I'm talking about getting stuck with the morons. Oh. Love that, though. Ugh, that feels good. Fuck me, man. There's a rocket here, but I don't have a rocket launcher, so I'm going to leave it. God, where did you get trained? Uh, why do I get the feeling? This is probably a bad idea. Um. Oof, yeah. I mean, this is cool, but it's a bad idea. Right, let's go back. I really wish I could turn V-Sync on, but no method seems to work. Which means the frame times are awful. Oh. That's okay, it's just it's just the thunder. It's just the thunder. We're good. Keep going. So nest. Yes, I'm gonna guess that the nest is gonna come in useful a little bit later on. Okay. Can we? Is there any doors around here? Yep. We, nope. I guess we're not going in there. Okay. So there's ammo littered around for guns that we don't have. Oh. And he also has ammo for the gun that we don't have. I haven't got the right weapon for this ammo. Just pocket the fucking stuff anyway. You absolute tool. 
Jesus, like, if you can hold it, mate, hold it. I don't know if you've been in any horror games before, Tom. Oh, great. But I would say they're definitely worth holding on to. Right, so we've got to go all the way back round. Because we can't go down those stairs, because that's blocked. There's plenty of ammo for um, an assault rifle anyway. So, I mean, that's that's good. That's definitely a good thing. This looks like the wrong way. This looks like the wrong... You're telling me that now? Okay, I think this is going to be one of those games where exploration is fairly limited. You're going to want to go straight point to point. Uh, Tom, see that? See that there? Thank you. Oh. Did you really just run through that? As I was putting it out. You really did, didn't you? All burned. You utter Doralingus. Right, well, what were you running from? I guess we don't really care what he was running from. Health is good. Alright. Stay frosty, Tom. Stay frosty. Tom, stop trying to melee the doors, Tom. We're good for the armory. Oh. Uh. Uh. Okay. Cool. Yeah, uh, I'm trying to open the door. But... I'm not 100% sure where we're supposed to be going. I guess follow the guy. Uh, main deck. I have to find the E key to access the catwalk. We've got the radio room. Okay. Must be near the crew quarters. Okay, god damn it. So, I guess we're going to go back to the crew quarters. Can put the gun away now, Tom. If I knew how to put the gun away. I actually don't know how to put the gun away. Right. Let's go back to the crew. He seems to just put the gun away after a while. And then get it back out again. Okay. Technically, I've got the manual for this game. Right, we... Still don't know exactly where we're going. Right, uh, crew quarters. So here's the crew quarters. That's the shower. We know it's not in the shower. We don't have a key for the captain's quarters. Locked. So... Showers, crew quarters. At least we put the fire out. I mean, that's something. Bridge, radio. Right, the bridge radio room is up here. Which is fine. But we needed a key for that? But, but. That's the room. But we've, we've got the key for it there, haven't we? Radio code. We found the radio room. Uh, okay. So that's the bridge, right. I guess we've got to go back down and follow where that guy ran to. Okay. I guess we're going back outside. To the main bridge area. All right, come on, Tom. I might start fiddling with these controls. This game's very, 
very hard to control. It's not the worst I've ever experienced, but it's pretty bad. Right, okay. So, we need to go back out here then, I guess. Because remember, this door was locked. I guess this dude... Oh. Hey, dude. Look. Can we talk about this? Yeah? Oh, you're lost. Right, we remember, we actually needed this. It looks like this will do the job. For the fish hold. Okay. Pistol ammo. Yeah, what about the uh, uh, MP5 he's got there? No? No, don't want that? Okay. Cool. Alright, I mean, it's just, just, just an idea, Tom. What the hell is that shit? Don't we want to know? Right, so I guess we're going to go to the fish hold. Oh! Hello! Get fucked. Hello! Get fucked. Hey! I blew your head off, dude. You can get fucked with that bullshit. So, to the fish hold. Well, we know we've made progress because the enemies. Okay. Here we go. And it was that door, I believe. No, that door? It was one of these doors. That's the fish hold. Right, let's go. Oh. Okay, I guess. Just save. Rooms are going to be a little bit more packed in, which is good. Oh man, look at that. Look at that. A note about red fuel valve. Okay, to Major Annie Annie Shenko. I'm definitely saying that wrong, but I don't care. Um, Red Valves. Major, it has come to our attention that some of your men have been playing at shooting the, <laughs> shooting the Red Valves off fuel pipes. What the hell is going on on this ship? Not only does this lead to lengthy, dangerous and costly repairs, it also causes a jet of burning gas to burst from the broken valve. Two technicians have already been badly injured as a result. Please order your men to cease this immediately. So they're littering... Um, barrels around all over the place. Uh, I maybe that's after the containment breach. They are shooting open electronic locks, and now they're shooting um, fuel lines. Ah, oh, Jesus. Okay. I guess that's those there. I've got a lot of those in here. Why do I get the feeling that something bad's going to go down in here? What is that? Oh, good. Yeah, I mean, you know, what could possibly go wrong here? Son of a bitch. You know, apart from that. Oof. Oof. Sometimes the gun doesn't always fire. I'm definitely noticing that. Which is weird. There we go. Yeah. These weird head crab motherfuckers. I was almost positive that was going to come to life. Ugh. So that is the parasite in question. That's what we're dealing with here. Alright. That is what gets into your brain and fucks you up. Ugh. Alright. 
Good to fucking know. Damn thing stuck. All right. Well, I mean, okay, I thought that was going to be a little bit different. Admittedly. I kind of had a feeling that this thing was going to come to life and, you know, wrestle with us. And some choice language and liberal application of bullets was going to be needed. I wasn't expecting to fight little spider things. So, what did we just pick up there? Radio room key. Right, so now we can go back. The damn thing's stuck. Were they expecting that to be a bit harder? Oof, I don't know. Right, let's get out of the fish room. I'm... Oh, hello. I'm guessing at some point we're going to be able to drain this area. I <laughs> like the little blood spurts pumping out of there. Good. Die. Die. Right, this is going to be delicate, I'd wager. Okay, this guy doesn't appear to have any other goodies on him. Fair play. Right, careful now, Tom. Back to the crew quarters. Let's uh, swing by the armory. Definitely going to swing by the armory. Pick up some rounds. Yeah, we didn't come in here uh, when I replayed the game. A note about the armory. Yeah, we know about the armory. Oh, come on. Ah, ammunition. Yeah, so I'm guessing that's just like an unlimited supply of free goodies. Which is nice. And with that, guys, we are going to end this video because we're on half an hour. And I have no idea when the next checkpoint is. So, when we come back, we finally have the radio key. Feels like um, that was fairly arduous to get that, but we now have the radio key. When we come back, we're going to go to the radio room and see if we can actually do anything with said key. And maybe waste some monsters along the way. I'm liking the zombies. The zombies are interesting and fun. I also like the headcrab type last plaga enemies that we have going on here. It definitely is starting to feel a little bit more like a Resident Evil um, ripoff. Uh, I'm a fan. I like how interactive the environments are. We've got things that we can shoot on the walls like fuel pipes. We have explosive barrels. We have um, fire hydrants. I like it. Or fire extinguishers, I should say. Yeah, I like it. This is, this is, so far, this is good. Definitely looking forward to seeing where it's going to go next. Anyway, guys, thanks very much for watching, and as always, till next time.